Welcome to Spring 2011 Women's Studies and Humanities, you might be enrolled in either, 209 Women in Film. Uh, this is an intensive viewing, reading, and writing course. However, you'll learn a lot and you'll definitely have earned the three tags that the vast majority of you are taking this course for. Um, this Getting Started video is to give you a quick tour of the class and to help you get started with your work. Um, so, if you're watching this video, you have found the course. Yay! Uh, over here on the left, there is a link to the syllabus. You'll want to read that and read it very carefully. Um, let's scroll down here on the syllabus and get to the thing that you all probably care about the most. Where is it? Where is it? Aha! Assignment distribution. Um, the, the way this course is organized is the first... Um, four weeks is basically a crash course in film studies because this class has no prerequisites. So we're going to spend some time learning how to learn about and talk about and analyze film. Then the next four weeks is a crash course in women's studies. Uh, again, don't have a prerequisite for this course. Uh, then the second half of the semester, basically after spring break, will actually do women in film. Not that you're not going to be watching films, not that you're going to be not watching films by women, about women, etc. Um, but the focus of the course in those first two units um, are kind of these crash courses in film studies and women's studies. And you'll have a midterm exam associated with both, you know, four-week crash course. Uh, and then... The following eight weeks, you'll have a major research project and a final exam. You also have weekly activities or homework, and that's worth about a third of the course grade. Okay, so let's go back to the home page, course content. The way the course is structured is every Saturday by 11.59 p.m. you have to do work. You don't have to do it on Saturday, it just has to be submitted by Saturday. Uh, you want to click on this Getting Started in Module 1, Due Dates 1 through 5. So notice Due Dates 1 through 5, meaning there will be more due dates. Another one of these sheets will be posted a little later. But Due Dates 1 through 5. So on here is the listing of all of the work that you will do for the next five weeks, basically, or four weeks, because there's two due dates this week. So your first due date is here, Thursday, and there's a list of work for you to do. And then your second due date is here, Saturday, this Saturday, and there's a list of more work for you to do. Now you'll notice this third due date is the following Saturday, January 29th. It's highlighted yellow. If it's highlighted yellow, it means I haven't finished uh, flushing out the work due that week. So don't start on anything that's highlighted yellow. But you've got your first two deadlines, and that's why the course is ready to go. Um, for this course, I'm going to go back to course content. For this course, you'll be required to buy two books. One of them is the seventh edition of a short guide to writing about film. It's got Batman and the Joker on the cover. Um, there are tons of used copies. I think there's um, uh, a borrowing copy that you can do or a loaner copy or a rental. That's it. That's the term they use. Rental copy out of the bookstore. Um, so that book you can get pretty cheaply. Now, another book we'll be using is called Reading Women's Lives. It's got a blue cover with a painting of different colored women on the front of it. Um, this book will not be available for another two or three weeks, so it's not in the bookstore yet. You can't even buy it. Um, and don't worry, you won't need it until we start that um, crash course in women's studies uh, aspect of the course. Um, so you'll definitely need to go get that A Short Guide to Writing About Film. You need that ASAP. Again, it's very easy to get. Um, and then the other one will be available, and I'll keep you updated on when that's in the bookstore available for you to buy. You will only be able to buy it in the bookstore. It's a book that's specially made for our class. Uh, however, we will have a few more readings in the class that are not in either book, and they'll be here in this file folder area, Instructor Provided Readings. Uh, we will have definitely viewings every single week. Um, I try really hard to make the viewings uh, available either through YouTube or something like that. However, there's some in the course, and you will be responsible for finding some of the viewings for this course. This, I think, is a quick enough overview of the course. Uh, there are two more technologies we'll be using. One's called VoiceThread and the other MindMeister, and we'll talk about those more as we get close to them. Again, welcome, and I look forward to getting to know you this semester.